What is up, my number one Crocs? I am Pete Plays, bringing you another episode of Pokemon Emerald. In the last episode, I left you guys an unsurprising cliffhanger. Yes, I did. We are in Team Magma's hideout, and today we are going to obviously delve south to see what is going on, what was so important. So before I obviously progress on to showing you that or whatnot, I'm going to show you the new bag. Well, not necessarily new, I just organized it somewhat. And you may see a few items out of the bag. That's because I have took them out for obvious reasons. If we go to the Pokemon, we will realize that I've organized the team a bit more because we're going to use these guys today. Give them a bit of, you know, limelight, as it were. So as you can see, um, Frogalier still has the Mystic Water, obviously, because it boosts the power of his Surf, of which he can't use right now because, well, it's run out of PP. Um... Narara still has black glasses because we're going to be using Bite and Crunch pretty soon. Um, I have gave uh, Gardevoir aka Veggiehead the Lax Essence to make him more elusive. I said him, not her, because that's a nice butt, Veggiehead, if anyone gets that joke from previous episodes. Um, I've left Swallow with the EXP share, even though we clearly don't need it, but I guess I could use it now to give her a bit of exp or him exp oh my god my whole team is like males or she males or whatever <laughs> okay so basically i've given uh, iron dome and orange berry just because i don't have any like other item to give him and obviously it's going to give him a bit of dynamism which is great so if he falls low on hp it's going to Give him a bit of vigor. Um, we've given um, Colloquir the Quick Claw, because as you can see, he has the lowest speed. If you look, he has 40 speed, which is the lowest in the whole team. So we've given him the Quick Claw, obviously, to give him a bit of alacrity, which will help him out when he is fighting. So yeah, that's that's pretty much that. Um, I also want to say something um, personal feels here. Um, I wanted to say it a few episodes ago, but I kind of forgot. Uh, the reason why I generally um, tell you stuff, so um, what's it called? I spoil stuff if you wish. Not necessarily spoil, I just tell you what's going to happen later on in the video. Like here and then now before we do it. For example, at the start of last video I was like, Well, Team Magma Magma's hideout is in Mount Pryor. Or Mount Pryor. I didn't go to Mount Pryor and then say, Oh look, there's a boulder there, I wonder what's inside. Because I'm not going to teach you guys like you're stupid and you've never seen the game before because I know how like cliche and blase this game is um, for playing and for watching as well and it just gets to that point where you're like I've seen this humpteen times I know exactly what's gonna happen please don't treat me like a kid okay and so I don't wish to treat you like that and that's why I'm not <laughs> three minutes rambling on god car okay well basically it's to obviously um, if I act stupid in a video it's a bit like me, a personal anecdote here. I shout at the screen, so if someone's doing something wrong, for example, I watched this uh, Let's Play of Hogs of War, um, and the lp -er was Malice Calabar. You should go and check him out. He's an awesome Let's Player. Um, and he was just... He, his commentary was great. He was singing to the tune and whatnot, but he was just playing generally bad, and I didn't really like it, and I was like, oh my god, you could have did this better. The mines do 20 damage rather than 30, blah, 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 whatever. And that's generally the thing, like, um, if you say something, um, rather, say something smart rather than act derpy about it, even though you're clearly doing it, um, when you you don't actually mean it, you know what's going on, but obviously you're trying to, you know, um, you make fill off your uh, commentary. I'm digging myself deep here, Jesus. <laughs> uh, basically, people would obviously shout at the screen, and also, it won't make you lose suspense, because... Even if you're new to the game, I'm not going to break the surprise for you. You could s still be intrigued as to what I actually meant. So if I could say, for example, T Magma's hideout is in Mount Chimney, you'd be probably thinking, where? I didn't see it there before. And then I didn't really hint at the boulder until we got there. So do you see what I mean? If you don't, I will write it as a comment to you guys in proper English, because that was probably in double Japanese to you guys, yeah? Alright, so, <laughs> underway, let's progress! God, my God, I, I ramble on so much, don't I? I'm terribly sorry, guys. Alright, so, we found a Max Revive. I've also cleaned out the bag a bit, so we have a bit of space for some goodies to pick up along the way, if there's any. Who's down here? Repels war off. I actually thought that was a dialogue box there, good grief. <clears throat> no! 
I totally forgot there was actually um, these evil guys in this cave. Whatever. Let's just quickly get out of here because we don't have any sir, so I can't one hit KO this guy. <clears throat> Groudon! Nothing could awaken you from your sleep. Bathed in magma, this blue orb is what you sought, wasn't it? I have brought you the blue orb. Let it shine, awaken you. So he wants to rouse Groudon for what means? Nefarious means knowing Maxi. Oh, and there's also something funny as well. What I didn't notice until like earlier today was Team Magma Maxi. Team Aqua Archie. You see? You see the resemblance? M M A A? <laughs> Oh my god, I can't believe he's so stupid. God, I'm so stupid. And show me, show me the full extent of your mighty p p hour. <laughs> Whoa. That looks awesome, it's a blue sphere that took over the screen and... Oh my god, Groudon's awoken. I could have sworn he was sleeping with his eyes open though. Pretty weird. And he jumped! I didn't know Groudon could jump, even though he's clearly the heaviest Pokemon of which he's going to create a, a giant earthquake when he lands. Groudon! What's wrong? Wasn't the blue orb the key? Groudon! Where have you gone? Oh, so it was you who scared him off. Hey! Come on, I've got a pretty face. I didn't scare anyone. I've seen you poking around uninvited here and there. I get it now. You must have pulled a cheap stunt. Oh yeah, I did, Maxi. Oh, that'll be a mouse bait! Sorry. Alright, so. I love this music. It's so like, Arriba, Arriba! I hope that wasn't the slightest bit racist. Anyways, Max <laughs> Magma Leader Maxi would like to battle. Magma Leader Maxi, oh my god, it's a tongue twister. Send out Mighty Eno. I was hoping you wouldn't send him out first. Uh, um, we're gonna have to swap out. Uh, let me actually check my summaries. My summaries. Um, I was hoping we have a fight. Ah, we do have a fighting type. Uh, but Rock Smash has a base damage of 20, which is not really gonna do much. Uh, why don't we bring out this guy? Sure. Yeah, shift. Bird brain! Give bird brain a little bit of sunlight, spotlight, light, photosynthesis, whatever, I don't care. So, he's a. Oh, you swaggered me. That was cheap, beyond cheap. That's worse than hitting someone with a fake out. I'd rather be flinched than be confused the whole battle. I mean, what is with you people? I'm actually speaking up to you now, rather than down to you. What is with you people? You're a mutt. You're a hound. You're a dog. All right. All right. So I'm so mean. Good gracious. All right. So I'm the fly. Okay. I'm the fly up, and then I'm the bounce you. I guess it's somewhat the same impact as a. Oh, that was great. It was like two turn, one turn. All right. Sweet. Is that gonna kill him? Oh wow! You crouched. You, you Haxor, you Haxorus. Uh, I'm gonna put you out of your misery right now with a wing attack. Fine, I'm still gonna knock you out with a wing attack. I recall correctly, wing attack has like a base damage of 70 or something like that. That's gonna knock you straight out, my friend. Alright, uh, that's great. He will send out Camerot. Um, uh, yeah. Yes, I will. Uh, but I don't have any water. That's, that's the thing. I totally forgot he had Camerot. It's a bit stupid because Tabitha has Camerot as well. I think they have like similar, similar Pokemon. Uh, what hurts Camerot? It's been so ages. I've totally forgot like half of what super effective is what. So soon when I get my internet back. Obviously because I don't have internet at home. Uh, well, not too much internet because my dongles ran out again. My dongle ran out last night actually. After I made the video. <gasps> oh, it's so funny! So now I have to top up the stupid dongle again. Which is it's dumb. I can't check out the super effective moves. I should have checked it out last night or like print screen or something. But whatever, I don't really care. So basically, uh, what effects other than surf on fire type? God, people are probably shouting at the screen now. You're so stupid, man! This does this much damage, man! Oh my god, man! 
Alright, chill. I will learn tomorrow. If you want to spank me, come to my house with a whip and spank me. Don't get any ideas. That Someone's probably going to come to my house and try to spank me. <sighs> Fine, just once. You can spank me once. Okay, you can spank me twice. As long as you don't leave any marks. Or serious marks. You can leave a few marks. That might, that might be fun. Amnesia! Come on, stop toying with me, sir. Yeah, you know you want to sit on my face, don't you? Okay, this is PG rated. I'm terribly sorry. <coughs> so, die! Come, what? No, 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 no! Uh, oh. oh, come on! <laughs> I'm sorry, Veggie Head! <laughs> oh, God! Wait, fly into. Wait. No, come on, you cheapo! Does, does flying type is super effective? No, it's not. What is super effective then? Wait, please kill him, please kill him. No! No, you're bullying me now. What the hell? Oh my god. Okay, okay. It's kind of funny because I'm at hyper and I haven't drunk a coffee, but then I get. Oops. But then again, I did kind of drink like this Starbucks. Um. I think it's a frappuccino, which just kind of equates to a coffee, don't it? Yeah, I think it does. I don't really use a wing attack. You're gone. You're out of here, kaput! You have been shot to kingdom come and back. 46. <laughs> come. <laughs> oh, God. All right, so I probably should have brought out Psychic. That's basically a Zubat in my eyes. So I'm going to bring out Psychic. No! No! <laughs> oh my god, Re Veggie Head! Okay, who else is psychic? We must save the team! Psybeam! Wait, how much is that base? Damage six five. Okay, uh, well, I give it a quick claw, so that should be good. I'm gonna bring out you! Yes, I'm gonna bring out you. So, Color Queer, please don't get one shot. Ouch. 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 Okay, so now I have a quick claw, which means I'm in command. I say what goes. What the hell? No! 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 Oh my god! Oh, 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 what the hell? Oh my god! Holy oh, shit! Oh my god! He's on roids! This crowbat is on roids! Oh my god! Oh my god! Okay, okay! I'm, I'm gonna take this much more seriously now! That crowbat is seriously on roids. Oh my god. No, what did I do? No! Oh my god! Oh my god! Holy shit! Holy crap! Come on, Iron Dome, please! <laughs> please, Iron Dome, tank it! Tank it for the love of cheese! Oh, thank god! <laughs> I'm losing it! I'm losing it! Oh my god! Wait, so I gave him an orange bow. I thought he had the lax essence. Hence why the stupid twat missed. <laughs> oh god! Okay. Um, isn't this super effect? Don't bite me! I, I feel so good, but don't bite- What the hell? <laughs> no! <laughs> I love you, Crowbat! You're making me lose my voice! Oh my god, <laughs> It's been 14 minutes! What? I guess one that was super effective! Oh my god, I feel high as a kite right now! Oh my god! I need to calm down. I'm gonna go play it safe. I'm gonna play it safe. No! Come on! Stop biting me, it feels so good. <laughs> Look at those gnashes. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wow. I feel so lightheaded right now. Take him out with an ice beam. Oh god. No! What is the flinch rate on that? It's so high! It's so freaking high! What? That was super fit. Oh, oh wow, really? 
That was super effective. Wait, so Ice is super effective against Poison. Wait, Zubat is Poison type, right? Flying Poison type. I don't even know. I'm probably thinking of Grimer, but then again, Grimer is not Flying type. <laughs> you, <th> you think I didn't know that? With Groudon gone, there is no longer any need for this blasted volcano. Dude, this volcano is a legacy. I am going after Groudon. So this is where we part. Oh, come on! I, I loved you! I loved you! Oh my god! I didn't really. No! Oh my god! Dun 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 dun! It's a torco and I am going to stick something in your hole! Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I'm really, really hyper right now. I don't know. It's like some of these battles, they just. Oh my god. They transform me into something out of the ordinary oh my god I fell in a pure state of super lunar ataraxy then oh my god all right so let's get this quickly I just want a super repel which is great an escape room I you having a laugh mate I'm gonna use that in a sec but then again there might be something up here what does this lead to I'm not gonna use an escape rope yet is there anything in here no there's no response I just want to make sure. Oh, it leads to here. <laughs> oh, she's <laughs> loving. <coughs> oh my god! All right. So now we've done that. It took half the episode, but most of the ep whole the whole episode. Okay, this is the end of the episode, guys. Thanks so much for watching. If you do appreciate it, give me a like and I'll kiss this girl and I'll take her out and I'll buy her. And I'm not. It's not the end of the episode, guys. We've still got a few minutes left, so I want to do some things really quickly. So basically, what I'm going to do is I'm going to fly to Morville, wherever Mor Morville's here. Um, I'm going to fly to Morville, and then I'm going to go to the community center. I mean, the um, medical help center, the psychiatric help center, and then I'm going to... Oh, she looks like Roxanne. <laughs> and then I'm going to heal my Pokemon. Our Pokemon, the Pokemon, her Pokemon. Is that Nurse Joy? Fitty! Did she just wink at me? What was that? Hey, what up, babe? Oh, oh, oh! Is, is 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 that what is that what you how you feel? Okay. All right. So I'm gonna like put one of my Pokemon in here. <laughs> See ya! I'm gonna deposit a Pokemon. <coughs> um, <clears throat> who do I not like? Do I not like? Because that made sense. I'm gonna store you in box ten because that's where Purgatory is, and you're gonna stay in there for all eternity. Um. Actually, I'm going to show the Marvel Game Corner in the next episode because we're short of time. I guess this episode was pretty fun in its entire, in its minority. Um, I have to go to Lava Ridge for some lava cookies because we're going to play Soggy Biscuit. We're, we're, we're not, we're not going to play Soggy Biscuit. I wanna, I wanna go in here, please. Can I? Yeah, yeah. No, but now I feel like a redead or a mummy or something. Generally, same thing, really. <gasps> oh my god, I love the footprint mechanic, it's so awesome! Okay, well, basically, so I need to speak to this old man. Being buried in his heart sand is <sighs> so warm and heavenly. Eh? Yeah, oh, oh, Pokemon nicked my bum! <laughs> hey, I have an egg. Wow, have you been ovulating? Uh, I, I mean, have you been, um. Oh, you have an egg. An open hatch by me sitting on it all day. Oh my god, you'd crack it, you fat lump, you fat poor. I know I'm touching my company in a hot sound of hot springs, but that doesn't seem to be enough. I've heard it would be best if we were kept together with Pokemon and carried up for all your training. Yes, and you should Pokemon ready for eternity. So, what do you say? Like that. Yeah, well, so we obtained an egg. So. No, I'm not. I'm, I'm really high. So, maybe. That was my mom. So basically, oh my god, what's that there? Oh, it's a hot spring. So basically, uh, you can hatch an egg faster if you have Macargo in your inventory. I think Macargo is third gen. Um, so yeah, maybe I could get Macargo and hatch it. Um, I'm going to tell you what the egg is at a later date when it actually hatches. But for now, we're not going to hatch it. I'm going to put this straight into here because... Actually, I should probably keep it on me, shouldn't I? Yeah, I should probably do that. <laughs> I'm so stupid. Okay, so, um, what next? Uh, we're gonna go to Lily Cove. I will be back in Moorville soon, just because 
Well, I said so, you know. You have to abide by my rules, isn't it, bruh? Yeah. Yeah, bruh. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, just because I think it's prudent enough uh, to do it another time because we're going to be playing a little bit of gambling, bruh. A little bit of rapacity, bro. Yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh, she's so nice. She's so nice. That sugar and spice. Alright, so um, I can't remember what she has. Uh, but obviously, we've healed our Pokemon. Which means they have their PP back as well as their HP, but we don't care about HP because HP sucks. PP rules! And, um. What does she actually have? She has a Swampert. She has an Electrike. So. What does Iron Dome have? He doesn't have a uh, ground type move, which generally sucks. Um. Hmm. I want to get rid of Rock Smash, but I don't know where the move the leader is. That's the thing. I, c I cannot remember for the life, life of me. But yeah, so she has those two. Um, do we have a a thunder type move, an electric type move? Uh, no, we don't, do we? We're gonna need one. But then again, we do have Giga Drain. So Giga Drain can substitute for electric because Giga Drain's grass and it's pretty good against uh, Swampert because obviously water type, water type. I have the upper end advantage because I'm a water type with grass type move. Which is generally great. You guys are probably thinking like, What is he talking about? He's on LSD, man. Oh, yes, I'm actually on LSD. Not really, but you know. I can dream. I'm just kidding. Oh, hey, Pete, are you shopping too? I've been a whole bunch of thousand posters. Typical teen. I'm probably going to get a lot of hate for that. Of course, I've also caught a lot of ST Pokemon. And I'm raising them properly too. You better be. Mmm. -hmm. Actually, I'm worried if you're raising Pokemon properly, Pete. I am! God! I, f I feed them the cane every once in a while. <laughs> I don't really. I'm not, I'm not that way inclined. I'll battle with you so you can show me your... 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 I can... so you can show me your thing, Pete. Yeah. Alright, babe. Come on then. The Pokemon I raise won't be beaten by your thing, Pete. <laughs> you most definitely will. You bend over that sign! <laughs> I'm sorry. It's just my nature to be this this disturbing. Mentally as well as obviously physically. Tropius! Oh my god! Those those things on his chin are so they're so weird. Um I don't even know what to do. I'm gonna try and knock it out with a water type, really. But then again, it has the upper advantage. I'm sorry, I blimmin' asked. It has the upper advantage, because if it uses a grass move on me, it's going to do a lot of damage. So obviously I'm water type. So, um... I could go ahead with a ghost type. Yeah, that'd be regular. Oh! Oh, wow, well, that's GG! That... What? I'm water... T Magical Leaf is grass type, right? I am water type, right? What? I'm water grass. Oh, I'm water grass. <laughs> Swamp at your murks, bro. I'm sorry, but like, that is just OP. Water and grass type. Do you know how powerful that is? That is powerful beyond your wildest imaginations. <laughs> Alright, so I brought this guy out because obviously this guy's grass type, which means flying is super effective. Unless I'm stupid. No, I'm not stupid. I'm a bit stupid. Actually, I'm really stupid. <laughs> what am I talking about? God, I'm so modest. Alright, so basically, we brung this guy out, but I kind of pressed the wrong button, so that means we're going to have to try and knock it out fast, because I kind of wanted to, you know, use water on it, but whatever, it doesn't really matter. It's very weak defense, so it's fine. It's a bit like a Zigzagoon in defense, or a Puccina. Uh, Ludicolo. Now, this is where I'm going to change my Pokemon, because I want to bring out Fregalilli. Wait, Ludicolo? No! No, Ludicolo! Oh my god, that's grass type. Ah, this is where a lightning type move, a, a freaking thunder, a, a electric type, what am I saying? An electric type move will come in handy. Uh, go start regular effective. But then again, it's weak, so it's not gonna do. Did you just use the same move? You're, you're a copycat. Generally, let's see if she has something. Okay, no. Ouch. 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 I love Swift. And I also love Tri-Attack, actually. I don't know if I've mentioned that before. I probably have, but Swift and Tri-Attack are so sexy. They really are. They appeal to me a lot. 
because when I used to play Pokemon Stadium, oh my god, I can't believe I'm getting so anecdotal in my old age, Jesus Christ. Alright, so basically, I, I didn't use his name in vain, I, I, I love him, he's, he's awesome. So, so basically, um, what was I even going to say? God, I not dig myself deep, don't I? <laughs> uh, this is going to be a 25 minute episode, guys, I hope you're in, uh, happy with that. So basically, um, come back to me. So I'm going to use Ice Beam while I contemplate on what exactly what I was saying. Oh yeah, I'm getting very anecdotal. Oh, Frozen, GG. So basically, when I used to... What? That was quick! Oh my god! Wow, you're pro! Okay, try getting out of this one, you blighter. So basically... Oh my god. Stop sapping me! So basically... Stop sucking me... <laughs> Yeah. So, oh my god. So basically, when I used to play Pokemon Stadium, uh, they used to use Try Attack and Swift a lot. And it was so awesome because, well, it just looked awesome. The animations were awesome and they kind of gave me a, a pretty stiff erection. So, uh, for all the kids out there watching, that basically means you see the water fountain in the park. Yeah, go and play with that. Alright, so, so basically, I'm gonna bring out Frog Lily. So yeah, so basically those transitions, those animations, whatever, they were very good. They were very appealing to me. I don't know, just kind of awesome, I guess. So I'm going to use Giga Drain. Please tell me that's super effective. It's not. I'm gonna eat my hat. Yeah, we go. Oh, a one hit KO. And that healed a pretty substantial amount of HP. So Marsh Stop is generally a bad thing to get up against, just because Mod Shot is very powerful. Um, but actually, as a matter of fact, Frogger Lily is very powerful against May now, so... I don't know why I keep doing that. So... It's okay, a not roll to prevent... Wait, cause a not roll for 2 to 5 turns to prevent sleep. No, that's not, that's not necessary. <laughs> Alright, sweet. So that's basically that. This, this episode's gone on too long enough. I'm totally sorry, but I hope you guys kind of enjoyed it. I'm thinking of going back to Little Roots soon. I've caught a decent group of Pokemon, and my Pokedex is coming along, so I'm going to show my dad. Pete, what are you going to do? I was hoping it would be you, but, you know, it seems you were on a different wavelength to me. Collect all the gym badges and take the Pokemon League challenge. Then come to my house and I'll give you a good time. I mean, well, so you're collecting badges, beat. I'm going to work on my Bogodex. I'll complete it before you. Of course you will, you freaking dork. Oh, my God. Oh, wow, she could have took my head off with that freaking bird. All right, thanks so much for watching, guys. If you did enjoy this episode, obviously leave a like, as always, because that's first priority. No, I'm just kidding. Leave it at your own free will. Um... Uh, maybe a favourite and subscribe if you haven't already because obviously I bring out daily content. <laughs> Couldn't say that with a straight face. <coughs> I bring out okay content. Um, decent graphics. A nice bit of, you know, how's your farm. Bye guys. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.